I'm the only one left here to finish the packing. Granted, it's not too much, but it won't close. We packed light. So next time when it's moving day, it's not gonna be as bad. I think the only reason this is hard is because I'm doing it by myself. But we went completely light. Completely light this time around. Like we got rid of a whole bunch of stuff. I could have gotten rid of more stuff, but I think we shaped it off pretty well where it's not hard to put anything in the suitcase and the big suitcase we have it under like it's 40 pounds so and that's usually like very low for well it's that's like the lowest an airline will, try, will have you will have your suitcase some are like 50 so if it goes to 50 we can get rid of a bag like this or make it very low so we have options i bought a whole thing a diapers and i did not want to leave it so it's coming Oh, I'm gonna put the website in you too. It's coming. But I'm gonna go try to sleep a little bit like them and then we can head out, get up at five and head out, leave by. So we can leave by six. There we go. Yeah, we go. All right, bye bye. Whatever you want. Restaurants, beaches for make surf. I am curious though, regarding the volcano, oh. do, do you go. Cause I heard some people say they climb all the way to the top. Yeah, you can, you can, you can clip the top. The only Mount Santa Ana volcano is the name. What's the name again? Santa Ana volcano. Santa Ana volcano. Yeah. Is it like a? a is it kind of hard walk with the baby? I don't know. I think that, that you can uh, uh, take your baby and clip to the top. I oh, you can. You can. Oh, you can. Have you gone to the top? Uh, I, no, exactly. <laughs> I don't practice exercise and uh, clip uh, to the top. Yes, it's uh, maybe hard. <laughs> yeah. Oh, how long of a walk is it? It's uh, one hour forty-five minutes. Something around from university is very basic. just made it oh my god my, i look rough can you do it i don't want to look this rough no my head killing me damn you gotta Are be you, showing your eyes and you want me to do it i don't look too hot out yes you do <laughs> your book has a go in. take it out there okay Where's it? we look rough but Ignore the roughness, but we just made it to El Salvador. Oh, we just made it to El Salvador, and let's just say we made it to our Airbnb, and the key isn't there. It's empty in the lockbox. Like, you see that right there? Empty. So we just sitting out here, waiting for the guy to bring us the key, or whoever <laughs> to bring us the key. Because around this time of the year here, it is extremely hot. Like, as soon as we got off the, the plane, everybody started, like, taking off their sweaters and oh, yeah. everything. We just came from, from Texas where it's a little cold in. So, you know, everybody had these big jackets on and everything. And as soon as we landed, everybody looking like, oh. I know. Everything was coming off. Dre looks crazy with his long sleeves and his jeans. But Hopefully this Airbnb, uh, this person... Be here on time. They said 10 minutes or less than 10 minutes. Uh, we'll see. Yes. But oh, our ride, our our Uber driver was amazing. Oh, yeah, he, was. he was just giving us a whole history, practicing his English, 
it, telling us so much about El Salvador. Yeah. But, well, we just ready to get inside. We're having a rough time. hanged up again okay how can i say what's been going on so far because we arrived in el salvador everything was fine no issue then all of a sudden we uber ride it was an hour away from our airbnb we get to the airbnb the um the key is not in the lock box so now we're sitting outside waiting for this the airbnb owner or employee or whoever to come and give us the key finally getting here in the apartment um i don't want to go too far into well no we came in then the other key that he was trying to give us the first time you couldn't actually remove the key so he had to give us a different key then when we were in here oh dre's not feeling well but he started not i guess it's not because of here of salvador it's not because of el salvador it, anyways so I was about to try to put Moby down to sleep and I was gonna go and edit. Then I realized, where is her bag that has the diaper? In the diaper bag, she has her laptop. We have our laptop in there. We can't find the bag at all. To find out, I think the last place we remember having that bag was in the plane. So it's either we forgot to take the, the bag out or somebody took that bag out because we do not have that bag and it did not click until we got to our Airbnb. This is frustrating, it's annoying. Oh, and the Wi-Fi in here doesn't work, which is frustrating and I've been trying to contact them and they're refusing to contact us back regarding the Wi-Fi. Very much annoyed. What a way to start. <laughs> but right now, I filed the report to his spirit <clears throat> try to call the baggage officer. He's not picking up. Yeah. So I'll try calling again tomorrow. Hopefully we can find this bag in this computer. Because if not, it's just going to be tragic. Tragic. Just as much as there's no Wi-Fi. How much we need the Wi-Fi. <laughs> but just updating y'all as it's happening. Pray for us. <laughs> right, sir? Oh, and, and for him to get better too. Oh, and the diaper bag had almost all her food. We only have just a little bit that she's already eaten from. So we're going to have to, he's going to have to fig, get some energy so we can go out walking to this grocery store so we can at least have food for her. But I'm going to leave y'all. Let me feed her and try to figure out some stuff. I'll keep you guys updated on what's going on. We went out to go get some groceries and some baby food. And some to at least eat in the morning. Actually nothing, but we don't really have anything for the morning. She got bread. But now going back to the room. And for sure we got water. <laughs> park everybody was playing at can't wait to go explore it but right now we're just gonna try to figure out about that computer and he feels better it feels better all right we're about to wrap up for the night see you next time